Welcome to Odessa High School. I'm Odessa's FBLA president, Zoe Clark, and this is our chapter. We are excited to share our Lead to Feed Challenge with you. Our projects benefited hundreds of people in our community. The cold, the hungry, those in poor health, and those who wish to be active. I'm Colton Hunt, and we are so thankful for our Lead to Feed training. We put our leadership skills to work this year, caring for people of all ages to make a huge impact in our community. Our project is Four Seasons of Service, and this is our Lead to Feed Challenge. We were thrilled when 19 of the 24 freshmen joined FBLA. While the rest of our chapter had received Lead to Feed training, they had not. Now it was their turn. Hi, I'm Eric and this is Camden. As freshmen, we're excited to learn about Lead to Feed. We spent October and November completing the Lead to Feed curriculum. We came up with the best service project ever, Toasty Tots. We set a big goal to decorate 100 pumpkins and raise $1,000 for our project. With our goals set, we put our leadership skills to work on the Toasty Tot project. All the pumpkins were sold. We counted up all the money and we raised over $1,400 and our project continued. You just wait. Twenty students were invited to a special party where they received coats, boots, snow pants, hats, and gloves. Hi, I'm Rebecca. Our winter project involved fulfilling another basic need for children, hunger. With 54% of Odessa's students involved in the free or reduced lunch program, there was a real need. Feeding children over weekends and holidays was the focus of our winter project, called Hunger Boxes. As Christmas break approached, we worried about what the children would eat. Our chapter decided to put our leadership skills in action and set a goal. Provide each child with 14 simple meals for the two-week break. It's a world of laughter, a world of tears. It's a world of hopes and a world of fears. There's so much that we share that it's time for a win. It's a small world after all. It's a small world after all. It's a small world after all. It's a small world after We established our backpack program six years ago. Our chapter used its leadership skills and committed to feeding every child in need, preschool through 12th grade, on weekends. With the help of our lunch director, we estimated 55 out of every 237 students in our school would participate. We signed a contract with Second Harvest Food Bank to deliver 1,900 food kits for the year. Next, we placed ads in the local newspaper, hoping to get a sponsor for each child. The cost for one child is $132 per year. We ran the ads for several months and got 51 sponsors to provide $6,700 for the program. I'm Chance Messer and these are the senior FBLA members. An interesting thing happened to us. We won a $500 award for being outstanding students who made a difference in our community. We attribute this success to three years of lead to feed. What should we do with this money? We found that Odessa senior citizens had a tremendous need for meals. We decided to use this money for our spring project, Senior Meals. Town, there is nothing more important than the local pool to keep kids active and out of trouble and offer adults a place to exercise. When the Odessa City Council discussed closing the pool or cutting hours due to increased costs, we knew we had to help. Operation Pool became our summer service project. 
A local nonprofit, Odessa Friends of the Pool, has worked tirelessly to raise funds to support the pool. We met with the group and learned a heating circulation pump was needed at a cost of $2,500. An amazing fundraising opportunity came our way when 300 members of the Department of Natural Resources camped at our school to fight a fire west of Odessa. At 9 p.m. on a Sunday night, we were asked to provide 300 lunches by 6 a.m. the following day. We put our leadership skills to work again and made 630 lunches over three days. Lead to Feed has taught us how to unleash the power of people. We were able to share our vision, develop a structure to implement our plans, and develop a culture that got our whole community and school excited to be involved. Because of Lead to Feed, we were able to serve our community fall, winter, spring, and summer. At Odessa High School, our FBLA chapter is making big things happen. It's a small world.